Cartoons of the Prophet Muhammad by Kurt Westergaard published in 2005 and then reprinted by the French satirical weekly Charlie Hebdo sparked outrage among some Muslim communities around the world and resulted in a 2015 massacre in France. Danish artist Kurt Westergaard, known for drawing a notorious cartoon of the Prophet Muhammad, has died at the age of 86, his family members told a Danish outlet Berlingski on Sunday. Westergaard drew 12 cartoons about the religious figure which were initially published in 2005 by a conservative paper under the headline, The Face of Muhammad, sparking anger since images of the key figure in Islam are not permitted. Sometime after publication, demonstrations, at times violent, were held by Muslims across the world in 2006, specifically targeting Danes. In 2015, after the cartoons were reprinted by the Charlie Hebdo paper, Anger around the caricatures escalated into a massacre in the Paris office of the media outlet. A man wearing a protective face mask as a precaution against the coronavirus looks on a painting by French street artist Christian Guemi, aka C215, in Paris Wednesday, September 2, 2020, in tribute to the members of the satirical newspaper Charlie Hebdo attack by jihadist gunmen in January 2015. Thirteen men and a woman go on trial Wednesday over the 2015 attacks against a satirical newspaper and a kosher supermarket in Paris that marked the beginning of a wave of violence by the Islamic State group in Europe. Seventeen people and all three gunmen died during the three days of attacks in January 2015 as a result of the series of attacks that terrified France at the time, seventeen people were murdered. Westergaard spent his entire life facing death threats and having to use a secret address and live under police protection. In early 2010, Westergaard suffered an attack by a Somalian man armed with a knife and an axe. Danish cartoonist who sparked outrage with Muhammad cartoons dies Danish artist Kurt Westergaard, famed for drawing a caricature of the Prophet Muhammad which sparked outrage around the Muslim world, has died at the age of 86, his family told Danish media on Sunday. Westergaard passed away in his sleep after a long period of ill health, his family told newspaper Berlingski. The illustrator was behind 12 drawings published by conservative daily newspaper Dylan's Posten under the headline, The Face of Muhammad, one of which sparked particular anger. The cartoons went almost unnoticed initially, but after two weeks, a demonstration against them was held in Copenhagen, and then ambassadors from Muslim countries in Denmark lodged a protest. The anger then escalated into anti-Danish violence across the Muslim world in February 2006. The violence linked to the cartoons culminated in a 2015 massacre that left 12 people dead at the Charlie Hebdo Satirical Weekly in Paris, which had reprinted the cartoons in 2012. Westergaard had been working at Gillen's Posten since the mid-1980s as an illustrator, and according to Berlingski the drawing in question had actually been printed once before but without sparking much controversy. During the last years of his life, Westergaard, like a number of others associated with the cartoons, had to live under police protection at a secret address. In early 2010, Danish police caught a 28-year-old Somalian armed with a knife in Westergaard's house, where he was planning to kill him. 